Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Fable 2. Alright, when we left off, we uh, just came to the town of Bowerstone, and we have a little quest to do, but first, I did some grinding in the blacksmith job to get a little gold, as you can see. I'm already up to rank 3. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to do any more, because right now, I can buy some property. That's weird. Game audio is not one to go. That's unusual. Be at the town. Yeah, the game audio screwed up. Give me a second. Okay, I forced it back. That was weird. All right. Anyway. <laughs> okay, I should turn that down now because me turning it up made it worse. <laughs> anyway. Uh, when we. <laughs> That completely threw me off. Alrighty. Uh, we can buy a stall now with the uh, amount of money we have. And I'm going to go for the drink stall because of course I am. Although technically, the one that's in my price range that will probably bring me in the most money. Uh, well, overall. It's probably this one. Uh, it just came into my price range now. Uh, yeah, the Bowerstone Pie Stall, that should do it. That should bring me in more money. There we go. The property is yours. Good, good, good. Now, because it's morning, because I worked so long it became morning, now I shall talk to the blacksmith guy. Is there anything in particular? Well, particular weapon eventually yeah oh boy i actually uh bought myself out of special on that today are you sure about that because it's still out of my price range oh boy i could buy this eventually but right now i don't have the money and i wouldn't have had the money in the first place oh well uh the, the greatest benefit about having the stall is i will earn money even when i'm not playing the game so uh, by the next time I do an episode, I will have more money. <laughs> Quite a bit more money. Someone has just tried flirting with you. Is that you? Well, I mean, I try. I fail a lot in this current getup, but I try. Uh, don't know why she was flirting with me when I'm in my pauper getup. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was weird. Let's see. Uh, you were over here... What else did you accept the bard's offer to be your guide? Weren't you guiding me earlier? Ah, oh, oh, there's some hello income. Again. Perhaps I could join you for another walk. You're such okay. a great source of lyrical inspiration. Well, I mean, you weren't doing anything before. Looking for something special? Didn't, it was kind of up to you to guide me through half of this stuff anyway. Is there stuff over here you still need to lead me towards, or...? Wait, is that a quest line? Them? I'm not entirely sure. Um, not whole islands, big freeze. I'll eventually get to that. Uh, I've already done that job for a little bit. I might do it again after. <laughs> oh, the yeah, they do have a sale still. Uh, I probably should get to earning some more gold. Oh. No. Well, you can always find me in the town square, plonking away at my. Okay. Route. Well, I tried. He doesn't want to lead me anywhere. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Let's talk to the tailor, huh? She'll have some clothes I'm for sure me. You'll find something you like. Oh, clothes and of course some dye, which is really what I want at this point. Really. Insatiable butcher pink dye. That's a, that's a name. The radiant pink of violent insanity. Right-thinking people of Albion may be reduced to simpering incontinent fear by its vibrant glow. Okay, fair enough, I guess. Turn yourself the glossy purple color of one unfortunate hand gesture to the burly fellow at the pub. Well, okay. Some of the descriptions of this stuff. Ooh. This is one of the rare ones, if I remember right. 
Made of common tree pitch, the darkest dye available and very popular with the youth. <laughs> it's popular oh, with me. Oh, you you say that now, huh? You say that. Periwinkle, color of flowers, tiny mollusks, mollusks rather, and that annoying back itch you just can't quite scratch. Really, that's that's the color of it. Eh, it's a little odd. Okay, let's look at the clothing. Anything's better than what I currently got. Um, I might not be able to afford a full set of this. Yeah, I'm probably not going to be able to. Yeah. I have extra clothing, don't I? Yeah, I have that assassin coat. Yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. If you have anything else to sell, you know where to find me. Fair enough. Why do they hate me? This is another one that just outright hates me. I just came here, damn it. That's dumb. Okay. Alright. Well, that's that's gonna be a thing. It's gonna be a no and an Eh. I can't talk. <laughs> oh my god, I'm having a stroke. Give me a second to have some coffee. Jeez, that was a little loud. Sorry about that. <clears throat> That's a little annoying is what I was trying to say that entire time. Maybe... Uh, maybe I should do some more gold. Just show off how how good I am at doing this stupid job, huh? Okay. Uh, there we go. It's shaping up nicely. Yeah, it is. What can I do for you? It's better today? than I expected it to. <laughs> I expected that first one to miss. There we go. Get some good money out of this. You can do it quickly too, so that's always you nice. Know how to use a hammer? Oh, that was stupid of me. Yeah, I know how to use it sometimes. Key phrase. Sometimes I just fuck it up entirely. Especially when I'm trying to talk and do it at the same time. That's going to be the bane of me. That was why I was kind of doing it off camera. <laughs> because I knew I was going to fuck it up if I did it on camera. Uh, so far, so good. There we go. Oh, there's a bunch of kids at the stall. I'm a little princess. That's a thing. <laughs> That's a sound bite that people That's can use against me now. Oh yeah, it's starting to look like it. That's for sure. All right, perfect, perfect. There we go. Ah, my income came through. It almost fucked me up though. <laughs> and I'm making a couple of them for you. How about that? Eh? Gonna mention that? No? Keep hitting it. Probably like not. I'm a nobody at this point. So no one knows my name in the first place. There we go. That's ah, beautiful. I love it. I love it. Perfect. Perfect. Uh Ow, oh, really? I hit the button on time. That's bullshit. Sometimes the lagginess of the uh Little cursor there can uh, bite you in the ass. There we go. Now I'm starting to get back into the rhythm of it. There we go. Sometimes you need to do it ahead of when it actually hits the green bar, and then it'll work. But if you do it, you know, before that, a little too early, sometimes it won't. Oh, come on. You whore. You buggery whore. Okay. And there. Got it. Weapons don't get any better than these. Well, I mean, if it's not made by me. Okay, I'm fucking up. <laughs> I'm fucking up because I keep talking to the guy. Alrighty. How much gold did I get out of that? I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> I was paying more attention to the fucking bar. Uh, I have a thousand. Ah, it's That's a good. Sparrow, I see. Yeah. The world, are you? Well, I'm trying anyway. What will it be? I can't sell any weapons, so. Is there. I can buy the longsword. I can buy the longsword. 
This is not a drill. Yeah, an effective weapon in the right hands, this is considered a beginner's sword, more practical for training purposes in real battle. But, considering this is going to take far more time for me to get, and I haven't done anything really this episode except doing a job, We're having a special fuck it. Today. <laughs> uh, wait. That one's 30 points when it comes to damage. What's mine currently at? Can I wait it out until I get the thing, is what I'm saying. This is 20. Uh, I can wait it out until I get the money, just from I'm at your service. waiting on income, honestly. I could just wait it out far easier. Alright, alright. Uh, if you say so. I should probably follow the uh, quest line now, actually. The uh, current weapon set should carry me at least until the end of that. Kill them! Kill them? How about no? Well, let's not do that, kiddos. Killing's not good unless you have to. Oh, I could. Yeah, that's right. I had to go to Old Bowerstone. Old Town Bowerstone. See how my actions in the past affected the future. That's right. Well, hello again! Well! It's you! Well, yeah. you've changed since you were last running around this place. <laughs> yeah, you got a beard. Don't recognize what's in those eyes. Goodness, decency, respect for the law. Is that what you call it? After you gave me those arrest warrants, I broke up Nicky the Nickname's whole crew. And Lord Lucian made me sheriff. Hmm. Of course, then he disappeared. Well, of course. But crime is way down. An is urban it? renewal has transformed this neighborhood into the most desirable district in Bowerstone. Yeah, I can see that. Fantastic, isn't it? Absolutely. As a good friend of the sheriff, you'll find the shopkeepers here will give you a discount on all goods and services. Yeah, if they don't already know me, yeah. Of course. Yeah. The same discount extends to that sister of yours, should she be in town. Uh... Well, I won't take any more of your time. Now. Stay out of trouble, won't you? You had to bring down the mood, didn't you? You had to bum me out, didn't you? But I had to break it to you. I had to break it to you. She ain't she ain't coming around no more. That uh it's kinda not a thing. Oh geez. Okay. Doggo has something to show me. He just phased right through the fucking fence. That's weird. That is weird as hell. It's the first time I've seen that. Alright. Hey, there's some income, and... Got a jet? Hey, less a gem than a chunk of decayed and fossilized wood. Ugh, fossilized wood. I can't fucking talk anymore. Ah, I should have stretched out my jaw today. Ugh. You can probably find equally stylish examples from the wreck of a burned-down house. Wow, that's... That's morbid. <laughs> that's fucked up. Alright. Let's go over to the cellar, huh? Get in here. There we per 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 tiger burr. Fucking goddamn. There's a chest down here somewhere. There it is. Usually in the cellars there is a bunch of chests that I'm perfectly allowed to grab. I am completely allowed to. Hey! Watered down XP potion. That's fine. Uh, and that's it? Well, in that case. Shit. I could just drink that from the menu here that was one of the annoying things it didn't have like an immediate uh pop open menu like the old game did uh the first one oop excuse me coffee decided it wanted to get revenge <laughs> it didn't have it like the first game did uh you had to go straight to the start menu uh to be able to do anything and that would be annoying after a while but i mean hey it's at least it was more responsive than the old start menu. So, I mean, there's that. All right. And pop that. Whoop. Ha-ha. Beautiful. Now I can probably learn a bunch of new stuff. Uh, if I go through the start menu. Because apparently it won't let me do it from the <laughs> beginning menu. Oh, uh, whoo. I can learn physique and life. The stronger your physique... The more damage you will cause with close combat weapons. 
Yeah, do I want to go for damage or do I want to go for toughness? Because more life in the long run will help me. Uh... Hmm. Tell me in the comments. No, I'm just kidding. I have to decide now. I'm going to go for life for the time being. A tougher uh, hero is able to withstand more damage. The stronger your physique, the more damage you will cause with close combat weapons. Yeah, I do still have enough to actually uh, get another one, but I want to get one point in skill at the very least. Dexter styles oh. unlock special moves for ranged weapons. That's, that's why I couldn't roll. to a skilled fighter. Yeah, that's why I couldn't do the roll. I didn't actually have the ability yet. I forgot I had to buy it. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> While facing an opponent with your weapon unsheathed, tap, tap, bleh, tap A to roll in any direction, which is a very easy to use roll as compared to the first game. Oh, boy. That'll, it'll take some getting used to to get that down, though. There we go. Alright, and I can still get one more in skill. I can add the greater accuracy. your accuracy. No. The more damage you will inflict with the greater your speed, the faster you will be able to unleash attacks upon your enemies. Speed's probably better to go for, but I found it funny how I fucked with Teresa's lines. <laughs> uh that's funny. Okay, there we go. You have improved your speed. This increases the speed of all your strikes and how quickly you reload your ranged weapons. Which is a good thing to have in the back pocket there. I'll be honest. Alright. And... Away we go. What the... What? Oh, that, that was it. All that experience coming to me and... You know, making me stronger. Okay. Cool beans. Quest lines... Uh, pretty much guiding me that way oh you're a little you're a little priest aren't you that outfit all right dog hey hey i need to be playing with my dog i mean you can if you want but i mean gotta ask me first okay uh oh that we have as a weapons trader down beast. here you can have a discount yeah. you can special reward discount 50 percent holy shit I might be able to buy better weapon through this guy. <laughs> and for cheap. Damn. The katana is actually pretty damn good. It's, it's slow. No, it's not slow. It's faster than the... Uh, uh, ba -da -ba -da. <laughs> Long sword. That's what I meant. And uh, it doesn't do as much damage. That's what I really meant when I was saying detriments. Like I said, I'm half asleep. <laughs> it's... Lower in damage, but it's faster in cutting speed. Which is a good thing to have. It's not one of the finer examples of the sword that originates from the Eastern Zanarkin, Zam, Zamarkind. Sorry. <laughs> Zanarkind is a different game. Samarkand. There we go. I can't fucking talk. <laughs> Most likely, this is an Albion at blacksmith's attempt to recreate that fine steel well that's probably good enough really and the pistol will definitely pistol probably will come more in handy than this will especially because i can get the uh, steel longsword eventually and i know the other guy doesn't have a pistol which is the one i've wanted Ah, uh, the flint lock. Huh, the flint lock mechanism was once hailed as the second greatest invention in Albion's history of warfare, gunpowder having been discovered in Samarkand. Though it has been superseded by this clockwork firearm design, it this is a cheap but effective weapon, which, like all pistols, has a fast reload speed. Though it has a much shorter range than rifles and does less damage. Which, yeah, that's the basic trade-off. But at the same time, faster. Okay. Um. Sure, fuck it. You won't regret Equip spending so and long. continue. And I'll sell the old weapon. Yeah, the light splintered crossbow. I don't need that anymore. I can make a profit on that. Yeah, well, here's hoping. Well, Alrighty. Oh, I got... That was uh, sell and that was income. There we go. 
Now let's continue on before I fucking butcher more words. She's already gone far ahead of me, so I gotta keep going. Rook Ridge Road. Ah, oh, man, you gotta love the fucking decor of this place. They definitely get a did, huh, they definitely did a good job. God damn it. Dig spot. How did you get so far behind me, dog? Doggo. Doggery. How'd you get so far behind me? Come on now. Oh, point out the spot. There we go. Does that do it? Was I in the right spot? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. And instant Java Potion. I'll drink that. To help the health. Oh. Buy better weapons and upgrade your abilities to increase experience bonuses. Really? I didn't realize having better weapons helps. Hmm. That is something I'll have to keep in mind. I'll have to do that in the future. For damn sure. Alright. Heading into Rook Ridge. There we go. Oh, there's a new thing. It's a new sale. Um, it had to have been the stylist. Yeah, it has to be the... It has to be, because that's the newest one with the most days left. Uh, small st uh, Small stale. Small sale for the next few days. Dyes are going cheap. Well, I should have waited then when I was buying those dyes originally, shouldn't I? Oh, boy. I love that. Hindsight. Oh. Uh, bandits. Oh, bandits, huh? Uh-oh. Well, this is going to come in handy. Push down with weapon drawn while facing your potential victim to turn safety mode off. This will allow you to hit innocent people. And then they'll, the game will give you shit for it. Because of course they will. Oh, I can actually... No, I can't open that. Shit. I thought I had enough. I can get this dig spot, though. And what do we got? Opening a chest does not use up your keys. I'm well aware of that. Oh, a little extra gold. How about that? Okay, you know what? I'm going to... Hmm. There's wrecked. Wow. Is this guy scavenging? What the shit? To be fair, in other games, I would be doing this exactly. But still, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. I'm going to end the episode here for right now. We're a little bit over time. And quite frankly, I want to go back into town and get a better sword from the blacksmith. And that'll take some time. So, yeah. <laughs> I'll do that later. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games and fucking around Bowerstone, really. Getting gold and buying weapons for you.